newspaper man turned attorney Pete Slover of Austin recently was named honorary consul for the Grand Duchy of Luxembourg here in Austin. On behalf of the people of Austin, I thought it would be nice to present them with a flag from Luxembourg. First of all, tell me, how often do you sell flags in Luxembourg? Uh, I believe this is the first one since I've been here. <laughs> Now, i got to ask you this. Are we sure this is a flag of Luxembourg? Because the flag of the Netherlands is almost the exact same, I'm told. Okay. Luxembourg is on the top. Netherlands is on the bottom. So you can see that the two blues are different. Pretty close. Assured by experts that I had the right flag, I headed out to the honorary consulate, which it turns out is just a small corner of Slover's office. Those of you who know the words to Luxembourg's national anthem can join in here. chiefly into two categories. One is that there's a consular function and that has to do with uh, helping Luxembourg citizens who might be in the United States and specifically in Texas and die, get sick, lose their passport, uh, have their wallet stolen, get arrested, thrown in jail and that sort of thing. And I help connect them up with the country's actual diplomats and who can uh, and get them assistance. But the other part is to just basically help make connections between Texas and Luxembourg, um, both culturally and um, between the business communities. Folks. And you get diplomatic immunity. You can do anything you want now, correct? That is not correct. They what, made what, that what, very clear to me. What do you get? Um, basically, I have a filing cabinet that has the official papers that are of, of my Luxembourg office, and those are inviolable, meaning that if I were to be... Uh, have this office searched or subpoenaed or anything like that, that particular corner of the office does have some, some immunity from discovery. But me personally, uh, I get some license plates and, uh, and they get me nothing. But quite honestly, I think that this is one that's used in, um, informally at soccer matches and things like that because if Luxembourg were to be playing the Netherlands in some big important football match, um, it'd be hard to tell the two sides apart. So. Mm -hmm. 